Hi, Gemini. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below. If you need to get in contact with me, let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing the Gemini with a clear, concise message from you. All right. So, Gemini, the, the cards that I pulled off camera were okay or are you deserve so much more than i am giving i'm sorry okay so somebody's not giving enough they know you deserve more um i mean it's like a half-ass apology you know it's like i know you deserve more i know i'm not giving enough but sorry okay. the other woman will do anything to keep him trapped in a relationship you could be the other woman there could be another woman there's somebody here who's trying to keep someone in a relationship so it's the, it's the person who has the relationship you know who has the title so um if you are the outside person then the woman who has the title is trying to keep your person trapped to them and to not come to you okay failure to plan is a plan to fail write it down so some of you what you need to do is start writing things down. You need to make a detailed, organized plan. Organized, happy people build empires. Remember that. So write things down. Uh, do the planning work. Because you'll always, you know, it's like a, a, blue, a blueprint. You'll always be able to come back to your plan and say, okay, well, I'm, I'm supposed to be doing this. You know, I'm supposed to have this going on. If ever you feel like you have veered off course or you don't know where you're going, you know, because, you know, a plan, um, a failure, a failure to plan is a plan to fail, right? So I uh, definitely want to plan in place. All right. So psychopath. All right. So psychopaths can function in society generally average or above average in intelligence. They have a very engaging personality, um, no concern or commitment you know, ex except to themselves. So they don't make commitments to anyone else or anything else outside of themselves. They make commitments with no intentions of keeping them. If they do, they show anger and in indignation when their integrity is, is in question. Um, so this person, somebody you could be dealing with is a psychopath or this is you. There's somebody here who's highly intelligent. They use their, you know, intelligence um, to get ahead or to remain unscathed or to remain, you know, not deemed as a psychopath. They function in society. So it's not as if they don't know how to function, um, but they don't make any real commitment to anything else or to anyone else. And if they do, then they have no intentions of keeping it. Let's talk about this. Let's talk about what's going on. Could be dealing with a cancer. We got the chariot card coming out. You deserve so much more than I am giving. I'm sorry. Let's go ahead and clarify this. You deserve so much more than I am giving. I'm sorry. The Empress card. So someone sees you as the Empress. Abundant. You know, heard spiritual, open, beautiful. You, you might have the ability to sing or be artistic in some nature. You may dress well. You look good. Um, they feel like you deserve so much more, but they're not giving that. One more card for um you deserve so much more yeah the page of wands um it's like they know that they should promote you or give you more but they're giving you very little they're giving you wordplay with the page of wands they're giving you fun and excitement and then they kind of leave your life they're in and out um it's nothing more they're not giving you what you actually deserve here the other woman will do anything to keep him trapped. Let's talk about that. What can we clarify this card? All right. So two of pentacles. Yeah. So this woman keeps up a lot of drama energy around this person, keeps things going, um, keeps a lot of, you know, uh, situation, a lot of situationships, a lot of um, circumstance, circumstances. Um, there could be somebody who goes in between two different people. Uh, maybe the other woman or the woman that's in a relationship knows this, but she keeps a lot going on around him. You get the Ten of Pentacles. She's more so dedicated to the money, to the legacy. She doesn't want to leave this alone or she doesn't want to divorce her lifestyle. Uh, again, the, the money, the affluence, the opulence, uh, just the, the whole luxury lifestyle. Somebody is not, you know, wanting to leave that behind. Um, so this person keeps a lot of just little petty things going here. 
what is what else yeah two of cups she knows that maybe her person is in love with someone else has found true love uh real love somewhere else but if she can keep maybe dramatic situations going then she can keep this person occupied there's always something for him or her to do so if i can keep them occupied they won't be able to get to this love all right failure to plan is a plan to fail what is this about for gemini failure to plan is a plan to fail you need to write things down what is this about for my gemini's okay so yeah okay so you got five of swords and six of swords so it's like um d this is self-sabotage and defeating type of energy reversal so if things go awry or backwards or things reverse for you you need to always have a plan so that you can go back to that and get you know back in order back in alignment back in balance okay so that you can move forward so that you can have achievement so the six of swords talks about moving away from maybe toxic or chaotic work environments so when things get chaotic drama field or whatever in your business and your work environment you can always go back to the plan well I don't, I don't plan to be at this job for you know that many years or i plan to move up the ladder or i plan to do something so you need to be very intentional with your time this could be a test of your fate of your faith trial test you need to learn how to operate in the world ideas this the uh swords are about thoughts you need to write your ideas down let's clarify psychopath all right let's see what is psychopath who is the psychopath okay oh damn okay so this is somebody who has a lot of friends keeps up a lot of different energy they're in and out they're charismatic they're outgoing they're attractive uh, they're fun they're spontaneous they don't make commitments if they do it's it's only for a short while for them to get what they want they're gone this is someone who they they draw in energy they could be an energy vampire they want people to come to them this is someone who's possessive or they they rule out of fear scarcity and lack and so they're very possessive dominating or domineering they want to um, hold on to this is somebody who maybe dealt with childhood issues or childhood trauma the high priestess this is somebody who um, keeps a lot of secrets or keeps a lot to themselves they answer questions with questions they go around they talk around they talk in circles it could be you it could be someone that you're dealing with this is somebody here who just tries to go unscathed they don't want to be deemed as a psychopath but they are this is somebody who changed uh, friend groups a lot um, this is somebody who just can't maintain a relationship and never gets to the level of stability or sticking around uh, this is somebody who keeps people outside of their home or heart space more so their heart space um clingy if they do f like love someone or like someone yeah three of swords there's always miscommunication misinterpretation of what they say they alienate and isolate maybe themselves they don't want anyone too close yeah so this some um, this isn't a person who has high self-esteem but they may come off as if they do but they have very low self-esteem uh, you'll see that by the way they talk to people the way they act this could be you could be someone you're dealing with but someone has psychopathic tendencies okay i heard cry baby someone is a cry this 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 person will cry at the drop of a dime but it means nothing they don't feel like you feel or like other people feel okay this is what i have for you gemini if it resonates for you let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section who in your life is a psychopath who did we describe is it you is it someone else um what are you needing to write down what are you needing to plan for okay um and if, if you're in this third party situation do know that someone is keeping your person from you all right this is what i have for you get your own personal reading at the website level go over to the website book your reading there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time where i do a collective reading and then i answer your questions um thank you gemini many blessings to you take care